Top 15 Chiang Mai Temples Chiang Mai is one of the top destinations in a country that is one of the most visited in the world. Including domestic tourists, 10 million people visit Chiang Mai every year, pre-2020 figures, of course. The amazing assortment of temples in Chiang Mai is one of the city's greatest draws. Chiang Mai was once the capital of the Lan Na Kingdom in northern Thailand for nearly 500 years, and this explains why so many ancient temples are found there, including several of the most beautiful temples in all of Southeast Asia. In Chiang Mai, visitors can gaze upon glittering masterpieces of Burmese temple architecture, golden-plated stupas, ancient temples in a state of ruin, giant Buddhas, and even a temple built of silver. There are temples buried in the forest, built atop waterfalls, and looking down 1,000 meters from a mountainous slope. In this video, we are going to talk about Top 10 Chiang Mai Temples, Wat Ched Yod. The Wat Ched Yod is located just outside of Chiang Mai on Highway 11 towards Lampang, but is very easy to reach by scooter or Songthiu. The central sanctuary, called Wei Ma Fo, is very similar to the Mahabodhi Temple, and you can spot a few Indian influences here. Originally, there were seven different Chedis on site. Each of them was built for one special event, which is said, according to Thai Buddhist legends, have taken place after Buddha's enlightenment. Today, you almost only see ruins of the Chedis, a very nice temple, and somehow it reminds us of Ayutthaya. Wat Phra Singh The Wat Phra Singh is a first-class royal temple located in the old town of Chiang Mai. It is one of the most famous temples in the city, and almost everyone will visit it while in Chiang Mai. You can spend some time on the grounds and see many buildings, a chedi and statues of Buddha. Especially beautiful are the signs with various wisdoms hanging inside the temple grounds on the trees, tucked away in a small building behind the chedi. You will also find a large reclining Buddha statue. In addition, many visit the main building of the temple, the Wayan Loi. This is the only building in which you will have to pay a small entrance fee, Watsuan Dock. The Watsuan Dock is located about one kilometer west of the old town. In addition to the 48-meter-high chedi with its golden tip, the highlight is the 4.70-meter-high Buddha statue in the Yubasatha temple is a so-called third-class royal temple and there is also a school for monks on the grounds. You can often meet monks here, a very popular temple with tourists, which is also a part of many tours, but still definitely worth a visit. Wat Sri Suffin Silver Temple The Wat Sri Suffin, better known as the Silver Temple in Chiang Mai, is another highlight of the city. The entrance to the temple is just outside the old town, at the same street where the famous walking street takes place on Saturday, Wu Lai Road, outside as well as inside. This sacred site is beautifully decorated. With its very own appearance, this temple in Chiang Mai is truly unique and definitely worth a visit. Unfortunately, women are not allowed to enter the Silver Temple. But even from the outside, this Silver Temple is a dream. Wat Chet Jot the Buddhist temple Wat Chet Yat is located just outside the city, and therefore is probably still one of the most hidden temples in Chiang Mai. Here are several old chedis adorned with beautiful stucco figures. During a walk through the large temple complex, you will quickly notice the many snake figures, which are a special feature of Wat Chet Yat. Thus, this snake temple has always been a pilgrimage site for believers born in the Chinese year of the snake. Wat Fra Wat Doi Safa just outside of Chiang Mai lies the Wat Phra at Doi Sathup on Doi Sathup Mountain. For most visitors, this temple with its golden chedi and wonderful views of Chiang Mai is a must-see. Of course, we have visited it several times and told you about our temple visit in our article about the Wat Phra at Doi Sathup or Chiang Mai from above. If you are also interested in the mountain tribes that live on Doi Sathup, then we recommend to do a Doi Sathup tour including a visit to the temple. Wat Jetlin the Wat Chetlin, also known as Wat Chetlin, is situated in the old town of Chiang Mai near the Chiang Mai Gate. At the entrance of the temple, a labyrinth is built for the Tai Loi Krathong, which you can walk through with some monk statues. Immediately after the labyrinth, you will find a huge Buddha head, and on the right side a chedi behind the temple building that reminds of Ayutthaya. Most of the time you will be almost alone on the temple grounds, as not many visitors come by. But that's just what makes it so special. Wat Yumang the Wat Yuming is one of the most interesting temples in the city. Located in the mountains and inside a jungle, this temple is also known as the Tunnel Temple or often also called the Forest Temple. Under an approximately 700 years old, Chedi is a tunnel system located in which one can discover Buddhist statues of all sizes in almost every niche. 
Another highlight of this temple complex is a fish pond, where believers feed fish and the beautiful talking trees, where quotes and wisdom help visitors to reflect. The Tunnel Temple Wet Yumong is still one of the insider tips in Chiang Mai, the perfect place far away from mass tourism. Wet Chedi Luang Wat Chedi Luang is conveniently located right in the middle of the old city, walking distance from many of most popular hotels and markets. Luang translates in the old Lana language to something like very big, and the enormous crumbling central structure certainly lives up to its name. The main Chedi is 80 meters tall, making it the highest point in Chiang Mai's old city. The temple complex dates all the way back to 1385, but has had various additions, rebuilds, and revamps since. It was once home to the highly revered Emerald Buddha, which now takes pride of place in Bangkok's Grand Palace. Wat Chang Yuan About half a kilometer after the Wat Lok Moli, you will see the Wat Chang Yuan on the left-hand side. It used to be the national temple of the Kingdom of Chiang Mai. Today, it is best known for his Chedi with lion statues as a guardian and his great golden Buddha. Wat Lok Moli, located directly opposite the Wat Rajamandi and on the parallel street of the old town, you can find the Wat Lok Moli. Not far away from Chang, Fuet Gate, the temple was built in the 14th century and since then a few monks are living on site. Even today, you can still meet some monks over there. The Chedi of the temple is in contrast to the many golden Chedis of the other temples, kept very simple, but this gives a certain charm. Here you can spend some time and just enjoy the atmosphere. Wat Bufferam Wat Bufferam is a temple located just outside the old city of Chiang Mai. The temple is best recognized for its Burmese-style chedi, beautiful wooden lana-style viharn, and the two-story home of Thin Tham, the Dhamma Hall with a walking Buddha image in front of it. Wat Bufferam houses the largest teak wood Buddha image in Thailand as well. Wat Phan Tao Wat Phan Tao is an ancient temple that is located right next to the famous Wat Chedi Luang in the old city of Chiang Mai. Wat Phan Tao is one of the oldest temples in the city constructed in the late 14th century. Once it served as a throne hall for the ruler of Chiang Mai, now it is best known for its Lana-style Viharn, assembly hall entirely made of teakwood. Wat Si Muang Ma Luang Wat Si Muang Ma Luang is a beautiful Burmese temple located on the northern side of the old city of Chiang Mai. If a trip to Myanmar is not on your list, it will help you to get a glimpse to Burmese architecture style. The lack of tourists visiting this temple makes it even more attractive. Wat Rajamantian The Wat Rajamantian is a truly colorful temple and shines with colorful details and many ornaments. This temple is especially captivating with the beautiful, large sitting Buddha, just next to the temple building. Although this sacred site is not one of the most famous temples in Chiang Mai, it is still beautiful to look at. The temple is located north of Chiang Mai's old town and can be combined with a visit to Wat Lok Moli. Thank you guys for watching. If you want more videos like this one, make sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel to never miss out any of our videos.